Hello, this is Jacob Death, and we're back with Crusader Kids 2, Holy Fury. We're going to resume our uh, efforts to quickly reshape the Duchy of Monteria, as planned, in order to ensure our rule and continue prosperity in this region. And, let's see, there we go. So, yeah, we need to siege down the stuff and force our demands on this useless brat who thinks he can defy the Emperor. And then we will have peace. Again. Hooray. <laughs> yeah, once we go to the defense back, so we will be held back from any future ambitions for a little while at least. Alright, so that's the siege going. A little well. Enjoy it. Yeah, like the defense pack is back with a vengeance just from one duchy which is the annoyed fan. Yeah, these people are not Catholics. These are um Orthodox heretics. And when I say that, not like they're not Orthodox, they're um Well they weren't anyway, they were we call them Bogomists. That's it, Bogomists. I think they are now the true Orthodox faith though. The game at least. Uh Maggie art. No, I'm not building that's a titular title, I don't need that. But how long does this bloody castle fall? It's heavily outnumbered. Come on. Give it. Give it. Come on. G G had for Norway, are you joking me? That's not what I wanted to hear. Um But you had to employ in Norway itself, I hope. It'd be kind of annoying having them up there. They're only be for this. Alright, so, assault the next hold. There we go. 98%. Now we just have to push for the next hold, which won't take long at all. We can then enforce our demands of this brat. Uh, trade ground's been built. Good. Who are you? Some random brat by court. I'm not giving you ambitious then. Bandits, blah de blah de blah. I think why are there so many nomads attacking while at war? It's really annoying. And why are the Estonians not dealing with it? They usually deal with everything else that pops up up there. Defenders successfully raided the camps. Wow. Uh, oh, wow, the court physician died. Okay. Oh, quite a lot of people died. Court chaplain, right. Uh, you? Uh, you. And I'm going to need a new physician, won't I? So, scroll up. Is there anyone in the court who's got a lot of le- Yeah, I need to upgrade to look for one. <laughs> 17 isn't a good number for a physician. At least not if you want to live, anyway. I'd prefer my character to live for quite a few more years to come. I accept your generous offer. Shortly after you spread, how good are you? 13? No. I do not require his services anyway. 13 isn't a good number. I want it higher. So, yeah. Really? Sieges are absurd. There you go. No, that's not it. That, where are these goddamn sieges? Like, yeah, it's a freaking nomad group up in the Baltic. What the hell? If we just finish our siege so I can go put down some nomads. There, finally. I can put the brat in his place, start revoking his titles, enraged. Good. Now I can make you disappear for your treacherous actions, boy. So move my troops here just to, you know, pressure him into giving up. Your wisdom? Yeah, you accepted. Good. I can now start establishing a more friendly branch of my country here. Now the others, they're all bulgamists. Can I revoke any of this? No. It's more trouble than it's worth, isn't it? It really is. Especially with these bloody... Okay, I'm gonna go put this guy down first. Hold on. I'm just gonna... Yeah, I'm just gonna put one of the bishops in charge that's more problematic than it's worth. I have to put down some nomads, so I have to put off the whole uh, deal with that fence. So, 
for that. Let's go for Kalal, where it's called. So County Clarasi. That was called. Yeah, that's the place. Let's just start root. Like this is just to uproot all possible disloyal elements in my newly acquired land. Why is it that Estonians have not dealt with the threat in the north? What are the Estonians doing? Estonia, what are you doing? He's over Sweden. He's trying to take over Shjutland. Joking me, right? <laughs> Wait, where did we acquire this? Skadia. Skadia got Copenhagen at some point. I did not notice that. Hmm. I'm pause. Let's go. East. Uh. Rook the county. We'll do it now, I suppose. Yeah. And he's then where it is. Yeah, we're gonna have to fight this guy over this. I'm just going to raise the Hungarians to put this down because it's just more trouble than it's worth. Goddamn nomads won't leave me alone. Hold on. Send the Hungarians to siege this down. And now send them north and help put down more nomads. Like this nomad infestation needs to be put down now. Uh, Skadia usurped blah de blah. Right. Good. Let's go put down the rebellion. A rebellion? This is actually just nomad up right, what was it? Uh dangerous place. Oh good, someone's about to kill Wei Yun. Good. Unless failed you know, possible inheritor in my collection of caskets. Uh let's go north with this army because I now need to put down that Ooh, nomad. Also, the, no the Mongols are now in, in uh, Russia. What are they doing here? Where are my Hungarians? Taking a time to get here, that's what they're doing. Also, I need to replace you because a 13 is not a good enough number to guarantee you your place in my military. Why did this pop up? Get off my screen! Roslav, and put this guy there. Now your personal honor is staked on this. Oh, he's got two counties, does he? Okay, that adds a whole new twist on this, I suppose. Because since you're a traitor, I'll just revoke. Wait, why do you have both? What the hell? to rose up in support of his friend, I guess? I don't know. Keep going up here. We need you to go put down that rebellion. Uh, oh, he lost Gregarious. Thanks, game. Put this guy on my right. Uh, for God's sake. This guy, and yeah, didn't seem to be going well. Assault. It's just Hungarians. They'll never have the numbers to reach the Hungarian garrison. That's fine. It's had another bloody nomad coming west and cause me trouble. Are you serious? Seriously, what, what is this? The freaking. Uh, what do you call it? Is this like the Attila the Hunt? Is this like Attila to a war now star just go off or something for me? Because it's just costed barbarian immigration. Ah, good. Crimea converted. Salt. 100. Good. Get in my jail. And there we go, another province to my collection. And since you decided to join him in that rebellion, you're going to jail. Okay, I get to put you down then, that's fine. Go to jail and get put down, yeah. Oh, you just made my options easier, haven't you? Meantime, let's start setting up a count in this territory who could be of, loyal, of good use to us. Put him there. Grant him the county of Kala, whatever it's called. There it is. There. That allows me to then focus my attention elsewhere. I've almost arrived. It's just take. They're going right for the capital of Estonia. For God's sake, 
stop hindering my efforts to conquer fence, you buggers. Uh, the price of decadence. Trebizond. I was actually hoping that was going to be the Seljuk fall to pieces, but it wasn't. That's actually really disappointing. Um, yeah, we've actually slowly... We're almost there. They're, gonna, they're actually going to break through and start looting this prom. Uh, right. In the meantime, we'll start getting a quad to put this guy... Alentia took this. Oh, he's, he's Catholic, he's fine. This guy is the only one left who I really need to start posing then. Uh, Spymaster, yeah, you. Do I have a reason to? Let's have a look. Let's see this counter again. Campulan. I'm not going to pronounce that correctly, am I? No, probably not. Grand City of, yeah, that place. Oop. Just get the plot done while I siege this place down. We're not going to assault. At least not yet, anyway. But you've managed to send them running, anyway. Lower my levy, because we'll raise it again stronger than ever soon. Marshall has told me about his ideas. I really couldn't understand what he was talking about, but he has admitted his belief that this would improve the military. Adopt it. Oh, we're actually at the next uh, popular customs or tolerance. Popular customs. Tolerance is not on the agenda right now. Revoke the count. Not yet. Not right this second, anyway. Wait till the war's over. The Byzantines are. One of the Byzantine success states just took Fessia, or it's called. Yeah, siege is done. Oh, you won't give up? Alright, just salt the next hole instead because you didn't go another castle. She could surprise still willing to fight after all that. Measles has that's nowhere near me, is it? No, no it isn't. Yeah, it's like over in Scandinavia. My empire's so extensive that it immediately thinks that the plague's here when it's like on the other side of the map for me. Oh crap, we actually no, no, we're going to win that. It was just a really close assault. Jeez, um, that city put up a bit of a fight, didn't it? Yeah, let's put this guy away now. Be gone. And revoke your land, because you've proven to be untrustworthy with it. And we'll grant it off to this guy. Grant him the county of, what's this called? Truna. Turna, there you go. How do you make it this guy field? Not enough to defy me. In that case, let's just immediately revoke it. If we have to, we'll just call up reinforcements from the capital if he says no. Oh, rather than risking civil war, tearing the realm apart, I've decided to give it to your demands. Good. That worked actually really well. Okay, so now we got this. We've actually abolished that republic. Nice. Okay. In that case, we now have a much easier time of it. Which means I can now give this guy the duchy at last. Then I can transfer that duchy off to my, my loyal vassal. The king of Wallachia. Alright, there you go. Uh, it took a while, but I cleaned up your land for you. So here's the Duke of Muntania for you. There. And we'll lower the levy. There you go. The Hungarians are happy now. Oh, that's that cleaned up. So now we can just get back to deal with the constant nobatic incursions on my borders. I wonder how Estonia's war went. That oh, didn't go too well, otherwise I think I would have seen a change in the map up here. Uninspired. Oh, the Art of Love in Krakow. I to my treasury. Alright, let's have a look. How good is it? Uh, Art of Love. Where is it? Secret history? No, that's not it. Here it is, The Art of Love in Krakow. Written in a collection of poems, the tips pres presented by Emperor Dukat of the Vendish Empire are sometimes cla sa classy, occasionally crass, but always revealed about the intricacies of... Uh, of Polish living and loving. Uh. 
Assemble the mob. <laughs> Let's go destroy a trade post. Probably what I give permission to be built as well. Good. Have the crowds dispersed. Uh, envoys for the patrician have pressured you with a significant bribe in the hope that he, you will use her to spare his trade post from Riga. Riga. Which patrician is it? Oh my good god, look at him! It's like a Frankenstein's monster! Uh, the Swedish one. Destroy it. I just want to undermine the Swedish influence of the Baltic. Hazar, ground built in Krakow. Good. Good. Alright, let's keep looking through. Is there any... There's something really I need to build. Okay, the thing I could just continue upgrading if I really wanted, though. Let me look at the internal uh, power balance I've got going. If Winnie is really got a bit out of hand, but I dealt with that by making the adopt gavel kind. So that should deal with itself in a generation or two, so that's fine. Blasted fools. Well, actually, it's now become a nice bulwark against the Hungarians' ambitions in the east, at least. Glitch continues to be just kept there. And also, well, actually, it's become a nice little thing that you could use to eat away at the nomadic territories to the east without having to declare war myself. Pretty six per yeah, like we're we're eroding away the frightening levels, so that's fine. Another granddaughter. You two are useful to me, aren't you? It's a shame you'll never be emperor or empress, is at this rate. Uh nothing. We're running out of Star Wars. Um mission I guess. Yeah, mission. Old Republic names are really starting to run out now. Oop. And I'm not really gonna be in charge of education, I might now. I can't afford to. Oh Revan, what's Revan doing? Nine years old, and he's learned a nice deal, yeah. Has my son produced any heirs? No. Useless child. How about Weeun? Weeun hasn't produced anyone I- Oh my god, what is- Well that's fine, I mean if- If the Damar line dies out, I can just be the plays, what's her name? Hehehe. <laughs> High diplomacy is so useful, but I am now getting into- Look at my portrait. Look at poor Ducat, all the years I've hit him at once. Uh, Duke of Skadi, I guess. He's become a nice little power in that region, but yeah, make him that. And but yes, with my meddling, I've managed to ensure that I have a really loyal vassal down here to help boost Wallachia's standing in the realm, at least. And also, with, under that kind of rule, it should make the Bulgarians constantly cringe in fear now. Now, in the next war, what will I pu push for? I think we might push for this bit of the coast, or perhaps Vaiden. Vaiden might be a neat, uh, pretty good thing to gain. The Abbasids have taken a bit of Greece apart. Wait, the Abbasids? I can't be right. Oh my god, the Seljuks did just break up, didn't they? Oh, that is good news. Now the Fatmans are going to get a bit powerful. Oh dear. Uh, Krakow? Yeah, sure. The blessing just passed. Unfortunate. But yeah, that's quite good news. That means my vassals have a few areas they could push into. Attacking in the Holy War for Tripoli. Good. Good. My vassals might actually get a bit ambitious now. I want them to start pushing into this. Which reminds me, we need to send our chaplain to start converting some of the populace away from the Bogus faith. Actually, we have some Buddhists still in our realm, we need to deal with them. Uh, the chaplain, send him into the deal with the Buddhists. Execute Order 66. But yeah, this should do a nice blow to Islam if we push hard enough. We might be able to free Anatolia from them. My, oh, my wife died. Huh. Unfortunate, but not unsurprising. I managed to outlive two wives. Let's see if we get wife number three to be of any use. Hmm. So if you're paganism, really? Yeah. There's no one of any real prestige I can marry into, though. All of the. No one really wants to marry my emperor, oddly enough. 
Renee's, I suppose? No, she's lesbian. So I wouldn't give any many out if I don't even have a wanted. She might do, actually. Hold on. She'll get negatives. No, she hasn't. She's Italian. Yeah, she'll do. I lose prestige, sure, but prestige is gained to be so much, it doesn't really matter, does it? Alright, we'll wait for that. Yeah, like, the, the threat is just disappearing quickly. We'll be able to go to war again soon. I don't know what to go to war for, though. Did the Mongols take land from the HRE or something? Can't really tell if they lost the Mongols or not. 52,000, that's a bit unnerving. Oh god damn, France's tribute made a Samoy into a tributary state. I was thinking I might try that. But let's go after Sweden, actually. Sweden might have something to go after. Let's have a look. Uh, border dispute to border dispute to border dispute. I think we'll actually take Halland off them at last. Just to clean this up a bit. And let's see, is there anything else I could be doing in this area? Excellent. Yeah. Looks like they didn't last long, did they? No, the Bulgarians already retaken their territory. Oh my god, Sicily's called Eisen over here. Oh, my daughter, no, not Treya. Took this day away is all. Please survive, Treya. Please. I actually made a friend. That's my ambition for Vild. Nice. I think I'm all about ambitions now, though. Excellent. Good. A renowned physician. That's always a good thing. Hopefully my daughter, my beloved daughter, Treya, will live. Groomed. She's got all the good traits needed to rule the Empire once I die. Once I die. I'm gonna put her in Warful, because I get more of that, and it's... Fine. Minus six. Fix Prince kids with pregnancy? Yeah, pregnancy. I mean, it's 20, that's probably why. I don't know why per personal leadership wasn't doing so well. Yeah, like, sexual treatment. Even when I say not to treat them, I think the physician still does it anyway, just to... Uh, Mock me a little bit, but that's fine. My beautiful, my darling little girl is still alive. Well, <laughs> oh dear. Smallpox in where? Oh, oh god, right in Poland as well. I, I don't really need to worry. I think my disease resistance is so high now. I could close the gate, or I can. Tempt it because I mean the Black Death never entered. Pilgrims in. Out of the sun. Oh, okay, this one's getting to be called Balak then. Oh, a genius! Ah, it's okay, we're not calling him Balak then. Um, who? To, yeah, like let's go with Mark Ragnos then. That's a good genius, isn't it? Ragnos. There we go. Mark Ragnos. You're so perfect, boy. Why couldn't you have been my heir? Ah, oh, well. The Queen of England. Well, at the very least, we could probably spread our dynasty over to England, at most. Yeah, yeah, let's take that risk. Let's send him off to England, then. It's time to visit... Yeah, sure. Like, I don't think smallpox is spread to my capital with the hype of diseases that we got poured out of it. Yeah, none of these actually do that. Let's just build an observatory, anyway. Just increase the technology. Krakow will resist. Keep the ill out of my city. Sadly, I can't use the trick of open the gate and let it kill my family to fix the succession question because Damar is over in Italy. He hasn't produced me a single child either, so he's really becoming a disappointment. But I'd be happy if he did produce a child. I don't think her womb is going to produce you any children, boy. Oh, Wayun. Wayun's probably still got his wife in jail, is it? Who jail is she in? The guy in Brittany. Ah, oh, the kid of Prussia. Fortunate. Alright, let's keep a revolt where... Werrell, I think that's in Pomerania, yeah, we can put that down. Krakow prospers. I know a good deal when I see one. Oh yeah, that's definitely a good deal. Ho 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 ho. Oh yeah, this is good. Let's uh let's build a, another city here then. Get more money poured out of uh crack out of this way. 
All right, then we get the final one, and that would give me, I think, maybe one more barony. Yeah, one more barony. I think. Just keep pouring more bed out of my capital. Let's uh, take the risk and march north through the smallpox lands. This place isn't infected, is it? No, it doesn't. I don't. At least I don't think it is. No, no, it's not infected at all. Let's go put down the peasant revolt. We just walked right through the smallpox. It's bad. The well, smallpox never hurt anyone. It's murder the populace that were run up against me. Yes, butcher the peasantry. <laughs> Good. Good. Victory. Let's enforce our demands. Get in my jail. Execute him as an example to all other rebel leaders. Hand. Pretty vanilla, but it'll do. Huh. So, if that's correct, then we should be just about finishing up now, I think, for the for this video, anyway. Oh! Uh... Okay, that's the observatory built, so our tech should increase, god. Alright. Well, I think that's about all we have time for today. I'm the Duke of Death, and this has been Crusaderkin's Two Holy Fury. Thank you for watching, and if you like this video, like and subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you next time.